hello everybody welcome to my channel so in today's video i'm just finishing up my roxy's journal of stitchery challenge and yeah i mean it it looks just like i want it to look <laughs> i mean it really i love it i love everything about it i love the way it feels i love the way it looks i love to look through it um yeah so all the pages are sewn in except for the June page, which is right here. I have it half sewn in, so I have to just finish finish that. And I'll probably do that um, next week um, just by myself because I have um, a family reunion this, this weekend. And Monday is the 4th of July, so it's a holiday. And yeah, so when i get the time next week i think i just have like two two sides i have here and here to go um then that's sewn in so i'm calling that almost done <laughs> i mean that's basically done um and here's the thread that i'm sewing it with so here are my sampler sheets or blocks and then my journal closes so what I'm going to do is I mean really that's it I just want to share with you how I'm going to keep this closed um, I'm not sewing the blocks in because I thought about it and thought about it and what what I don't want is to see stitching like on the what the spine of my fabric I just don't I, I I don't want to so what I decided to do was to use this um, dyed seam binding crinkled seam binding and I am just going to tie it shut and it's it's done um, yep so that is how I'm going to keep my journal is just like that so yes so when you do go to open it right so you obviously you know untie it or we'll take it off um, and then even though the blocks are sewn down to the pages the pages are not sewn into the journal but you know what I don't think it matters I, I honestly do not um so let's see so like I said I'm having my reunion I have family coming in um, actually starting tomorrow Thursday and um, so I'm not gonna have any more videos until Monday of next week so I'm going from today which is Wednesday all the way through to next Monday uh, without making a video um, Yep, I'm just going to spend time with family and enjoy family me family members I haven't seen for 40 years. So that is my goal for the next several days. So I hope that you enjoyed seeing my completed journal. And so I will see you next Wednesday where I will be sharing, sharing the Christmas fabrics that I have. Thank you all so much for following along with me during this process and I hope they follow along in the next six months. <laughs> all right, thank you. And I have Rachel and Sarah's YouTube channel links below. So please go on over and check them out. And I wanna thank Rachel and Sarah so much. I mean, I, who knew I was even capable of doing this? I didn't know. You know, so I've learned so much and I love it and I feel so blessed to to have done this and they're the ones that taught us. So, um, okay, so that's it. So thanks so much. Next Wednesday, we start with Christmas. <laughs> okay, bye-bye everybody.